We've had some challenges during the, the COVID-19 pandemic, as everybody has. The biggest challenge we faced in the criminal justice system and, and from the district attorney's office perspective is being able to conduct jury trials, trying to figure out the safest way that we can bring in jurors to hear the cases that need to be heard. To have our community decide whether or not a defendant facing potential charges or um, um, significant charges is held accountable. That's the most important thing that we do in this office is hold the offenders who commit the worst of the worst crimes accountable. The inability to do that has been extraordinarily frustrating for our attorneys, for the law enforcement officers who have worked on these cases for months and sometimes in excess of a year, and really for the victims. Um, there is no sense of, of um, end date, um, no sense of finality for many of the victims in our community, and so the inability to do these trials um, that we pride ourselves on has been very frustrating. Over the course of the, the pandemic, we've had a lot of false starts. We've had a, a couple of occasions where we've come very close to being able to get trials started again, and obviously this takes the, um, the, the judiciary to authorize us to bring in jurors. Right now, we are um, looking at a potential start date, again, for our felony trials, the most serious cases that we have, of September 21st. We're at the mercy of the health department, we're at the mercy of the governor, we're at the mercy of the ju judiciary. What I would say to the victims whose cases are basically on hold is, we have not forgotten about you. We are still actively working on your cases, making sure that when we can, we can hold the offenders of the crimes that were committed against you or your family members. We will hold them accountable. Um, we will be ready to go. We are still working on these. This has not been a six or six and a half month vacation. We have dedicated attorneys, victim witness assistants, investigators, support staff um, who have been very diligently working on these cases and when we can, we'll be ready to go.